all about God. We're headed to Sturgis, Mississippi to pick up some more pigs and we're super, super excited about it. We're going to get five piglets and they are land rice mixed with Yorkshire and this is our setup back there as you can see. Um, we're carrying them in the minivan and that's uh, our setup. Hopefully they'll fit. Um, that's what we're hoping. But right now we're headed to... It, it, it won't be the first time that we uh, went and got peas. They had too small of a cage. Yeah, we'll have every, to... Every, every time we go, we break a it's cage. It's always too small. Too small. <laughs> and I was trying to get a bigger cage, but that's the only thing that would fit. And otherwise, we would have gone all the way to the farm and then all the way back the other direction. So we didn't do that. We'll see. We might have to adjust that setup and that'll be fine. But... Um, yeah, we're, we're getting a much larger breed of pig this time. So there, there's going to be a learning curve, okay, for everybody, right? Yeah. All right, so we're headed north to Sturgis, Mississippi, and we get to see another farm. We get to get baby pigs. I'm super excited. Everybody else excited? Yeah! yeah. We're here picking up the little piglets. No, no.
Mm-hmm. And he killed one. He had him and then he killed another a few days later rolling on the Yeah, I guess. The other group had eight. And only, no, had nine and only six of them made it. Yeah. That, that's usually how many they have, about eight, nine, ten, somewhere in there. They'll probably have up to a upper store around 15. For real? Okay. Next batch. Yeah. First that's batch is always slim. Yeah. I say slim. Ten. <laughs> yeah. Ten eight. So this is our first litter? It's first one. Okay. That's what's up. You know how to ride them, Tyler? All right, get off the temple. You heard me. You almost got on. Yeah. Look, he, he riding two of them things in. We did a bathroom break at the camper. Now we're just going down the driveway to the barn, barn, barn site. <laughs> Made it to the barn site. There's no one's put on his shoes, huh? I think you might be missing something, though. So we got got the stall cleaned out where we're gonna put the baby pigs in. And uh, we got Megan and the boys working on getting the pigs in there. We, we think the best way to do it is to uh, let them just come out of the cage on their own instead of manhandling them in there. But uh, they getting them in there. Got some nice clean bed and got a nice dry stall. And uh Got them in there. They look big on camera. Can I see? And we got them a water set up. And the way that we train our pigs to, 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 to water, to the nipples or whatever, get, get the uh, peanut butter. We just take some regular old peanut butter or whatever. And we, because the pigs can't resist this peanut butter. You I just take it and put it on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you. Just wipe it on, it on there. Like that. And they can't resist. Ah. They're they going to figure out eventually that water is coming out there. when they eat the peanut butter. Look, they're already like, woo, peanut butter, peanut butter, peanut butter, woo. Yeah. All right, so we got to uh, get everything set up for the pigs. We're going to let, let Meg and the boys go in and. Uh, let them out, let them out of the cage and see if we can get them trained to their water, water system. All right, let them out. Bag up, let them, bag up, let them come out. There they go. Welcome to y'all's new home, piggies. All right. Got our new batch of pigs in that stall. Settle in. 